yeah, it's uh, it's great to be able to stand here and think, um, you know, the last four years have gone incredibly quickly, but to think back then that I'd be standing here playing my 100th Swans game uh, seems so far away, but it's a great honour to be to be here today. It's been pretty well documented, but it's, uh, I guess the transition's been really fruitful for me, and I, I've, every day you sort of pinch yourself and think uh, how it came to this, but, you know, it's, it's, it's certainly not the end of the road, and I want to keep improving and keep getting better, and... Uh, re keep returning the faith that the Swans uh, put in me four years ago. If, if they uh, wanted to keep me here, I certainly would uh, love to stay here for the rest of my career. Obviously a big game against Collingwood and, and they're coming off a tough loss as well. Yeah, we've obviously had, a f had two weeks to think about it and they'd been the same boat. Um, spent a lot of time reviewing the game and reviewing ourselves as individuals as well as a team and uh, it's we've had a pretty solid week on the track and it's not going to change this week and we're going to come out expecting to really uh, bounce back and be in their face and we know that they'll probably be doing the same. You guys have hit your all-time highest membership today, driving towards that 40,000, a win will help that? I hope so, but uh, you know that's fantastic. It's great to hear that the Swans uh, supporters are getting on board. I've, I know that we've got... Um, I think the most supporters out of any club in the league, uh, it's just about uh, getting them to join up as members and it's great to see that they're all getting on board. So how tough is it to get a, a gig in the Swans midfield these days and you look at someone like even Ryan can't crack the 22? Yeah, it's a huge uh, credit to the way that the young young players have developed. I mean, Ryan's such a champion player and has been for so, so many years and still is and, and still extremely highly regarded within the uh, walls of the Sydney Swans. So. Um, you know, I'm just glad I'm not on, in the match committee, to be honest. Good to know the coach is going to be around for another couple of years. Yeah, is he? He just yeah, signed on, did he? Re re yes. Oh, yeah, good on him. Today, nah, it's good to hear. <laughs> Went unhorsed. In a 27. Hey? In a 27. Oh, so same, with, same as me, so good to hear. Ah, <laughs> uh, well, geez, I, I don't know um, if I can put it into words. He's, he was a midfield coach when I first got here and... Uh, then he, as obviously as a senior coach, just the confidence he instills in me and I guess he knows the way I work and, and uh, now part of the leadership group being able to have that uh, direct feedback with him and it's, it's just, uh, you know, I had a big, big part to play in my development here at the Swans. Are the rest of the family now completely comfortable with you being a Swan rather than a Hawk? <laughs> no, 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 they're not. I, I think I've succumbed <laughs> to the fact that... Uh, John Senior will, will never uh, be a true blood, but the rest coming all around. <laughs>